A sexual encounter might have led to the stabbing death of a New York radio veteran. Sources say 16-year-old John Cade has told investigators George Weber, a freelance reporter for ABC Radio, offered him $60 for rough sex. Charges are still being drawn up, but police say the teen confessed to Weber's murder. It makes the pain that, that so many people are feeling even greater to think that our friend died in, in such pain and in such torture. The teen suspect reportedly describes himself as a sadomasochist on his website, and his MySpace page includes several photos of him posing with knives. Police discovered Weber's body Sunday in the bedroom of his Brooklyn apartment after his boss reported him missing. Weber was stabbed approximately 50 times to the neck, the front and the back of his upper torso and both arms. He also had defensive knife wounds uh, to his hands. Cadiz and Weber apparently first had contact on Craigslist sometime last week before they arranged a meeting. Investigators say a witness saw Cadiz on a cell phone outside Weber's place around 6 on Friday evening. That's about the same time police believe the suspect was let inside. They say before he left the scene, the teen traded his blood-stained clothes for some of the victims, but he raised some suspicion when he got on a subway later that evening. The conductor on the northbound G train reported a passenger bleeding profusely from his left hand. The teen told officers at the time that the cuts were caused by a bottle. He was treated at a hospital and released. Following tips, investigators located Cadis outside a bus station about 60 miles from the crime scene on Tuesday evening. He was reportedly carrying a dagger, but police say they don't think it was the murder weapon. Mike Gracia, The Associated Press.